In the gut of a body, not my own. I can feel this case is nothing but trouble and heartache. And even worse, it's personal. A lit cigar pressed against a wound that never heals. That's me. The second time I've seen Icarite completely melted. Just when I got a little better at forgetting the first one. Look, let's not fight. Let's connect the dots one by one. If we agree with the conclusions, we move on. You'll agree with me sooner or later. The sooner we get this over with, the sooner you can write the report. <laughs> it's the spirit. I should clear up Sarah's doubts about the murder. First, I have to prove that somebody else was there besides Green. And when Sarah takes the bait, I'll convince her about the rest. He could have cut himself, maybe? Like how? Shaving? That's after we've solved this case. Oh, how lucky I found you. Okay, we still have shit, but we can at least ask two questions. First, what's the actual cause of death? Second, who's the culprit and what's his motive? Are you saying you're getting involved? I've already changed my mind. Are you the same with guys? I won't correct you on everything you just said that was wrong. Besides, I'm looking for more information about the evidence. But seriously, no more jokes. go to so much trouble. To get past the police reconstructor? The sequence of events worries me. I found some interesting tidbits. Please share. Only with friends. But I'll make an exception for you. Looks like something we can build a case on anyway. Well... That's a lot of enthusiasm, which I don't share. Hey, keep it to yourself. Whoa, whoa, I'm not trying to say we don't have anything. I didn't say you were. Now stop yelling. Yes. Some of these substances don't show up in the system. Yeah. How did you know? I'd say we're looking at an old-school cover-up. No. I don't think so. No. I mean, that would be... What? Unethical? the poison. Hey, we can officially call it a poisoning now. Great. You want to open some champagne? Hang on. Do you actually have some champagne? Sure. Old basement full. Vintage from the mortal age. 
James, this is fun, and I play three more games of solitaire, but it won't prove anything. What else do you need? More facts, or it's a waste of effort. Talk seriously. Is this some lame engagement joke? What? No, it's, it's not like that. I, I just have something for you. If it is, however, some stupid joke, I will get fucking mental on you. There is one more piece of evidence. Sorry? Why don't I know about it? It's not in the archive. Because it's not a photo. Oh, wait a minute. <sighs> Tell me you're joking. I'm begging you. It turns out I think it is indispensable. You took physical evidence from the crime scene? They'll put us in jail for this! Oh, shit. I take it back. I'd rather have the engagement ring. It's beautiful. A vial of strange liquid. Probably poison. This creepy voodoo symbol on it makes it more mysterious. More importantly, the material of the vial might retain fingerprints. What do you think? Show me. If you have any more stolen evidence up your ass, you better get it out now, before you hurt yourself. Not this time. Consult your doctor. There's even a term for it. Kleptomania. Symptoms include paying for it someday. Hard to believe it's been almost 100 years. Hi, James. Calling unofficially, not as a boss, but more like a uh, buddy, okay? Mm-hmm. The documents you found at Green's place, you know it wasn't anything significant, right? You mean to tell me that Green kept documents that mean nothing on his desk the day he died? Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. And you better damn well understand it. James, listen. I just need to be in certain, you know, relationships to keep my finger on the pulse, to react, and so on. And so on. Sure. What have you done with them? I wouldn't take anything from a crime scene. Really? You couldn't take care of them? I have to do everything myself. And remember, I'm waiting for the report. Your herm code? Nine seven fucking six. Around Liberty Island, huh? None of your business. Everything was in Sarah's hands now. Which was neat, since my own hands were shaking in a delirium I inherited after some punk I've never known. And one more thing. In the meantime, please send that damn report. What about evidence analysis? You got evidence illegally, and you want to put it in an official report? Let's hold off. I'd rather have a better view of the situation. We can decide later. Huddled in their little flats over the few cents they managed to save towards a new body. Never asking themselves whether the survival instinct makes the urban rats happier 
or is this only the selfish genes free riding on the suffering of subsequent generations other alien forces exploiting their drive towards self-preservation their desperate struggle to stay alive a little longer desperate struggle that even green is eventually lost citizen either. No way. James, are you in front of the board? No, I went out for a breather. That sample, you were right. It's definitely poison, but that's not all. There was a fragment of a print on it. I managed to reconstruct it and search the database. So whoever that print belongs to, that's our murderer? Maybe. A person of interest, for sure. It's a damn big fish. Slippery, too. Oh, you're gonna make me beg. What's the fucking name? I don't want to say right now. Somebody on the street might overhear. I sent you everything by snail mail. Let me know as soon as you get it. Deja vu. The island with the imitation sun. We never had time to go there. At parties, I said I smashed it with the ball during the game. The truth is, it was after the game. And I had a ball-shaped stone trophy. A football trophy. Deadly poison is atropine. Okay, great. It was Kovalev's fingerprint on the murder weapon, huh? I knew it. You still think we can't clear this one? I wouldn't start celebrating yet. We'll never get to him. He basically never steps outside Icarus. But you do believe this is a murder now? Well, yes. But... Special announcement. Engine problems have been reported aboard Icarus, which is currently flying over Brooklyn. We ask residents of the borough to stay at home and shelter in place. There is no need to worry. Insurance for bodily injuries will be fully applicable. James, did you hear the announcement? 
I even felt it. Damn. Are you that close to it? Are you all right? The news feed said it crashed into a building and that it's about to fall into a chasm. Yeah. We can't pass up a fucking golden opportunity like this. Pass up a go- No, wait, James, are you crazy? Too late, bye! The bar was named Icarus and met its end fittingly. I didn't have time to savor the irony. An impossible chance to get Kovalev has just fallen out from the sky into my very lap. Or at least my very neighborhood. Are you hearing this? Fire department on site. Ambulances in 13 minutes. Secure the area. Do not go inside. I say again, do not go inside. Sounds like good advice. I prefer to interrogate corpses. Their deaths tell me more than their lies would. James, evacuate whoever you can and get the fuck out of there. Little late for that. See for yourself. Oh shit. What the fuck? Good question. Help me identify Kovalev. I bet his corpse will open right up if we ask it all nice like. about this one? That's not him either. Kovalev is fatter. I bet the contents of this bar cost more than the place itself. 
itself. And that's all that's left of the bar. Guess I was late for the ride. Yeah. You know the feeling when you're not even aware something exists, so you don't need it, but as soon as you see it? Pouring from a bottle is such a hard job. That's how much you drink. whatsoever. Burned to a crisp. It's hard to tell from his face, but no, it's not him either. Wrong bone structure. Shit, can't find it. Moving on to reconstruction. James, we don't have time. Sarah, I'm going to find out what happened here, full stop. Understand? Okay. Sure. Fuck. Construct the lock. Fuck. It's as far back as it'll go. So we don't know what caused the explosion. Not yet. James, if Kovalev finds out. This whole place is about to fall apart and take Kovalev's secrets with it. I'm not about to let that bastard get away from me again. Hey, if you fall, I'll say you acted alone. I'm fucking serious. Fine. Let's get to work.
is his bar. Bloody Mary, so to speak. Let's follow the trail. The traces lead here. Some unidentified substance. Reeds is flammable. Kovalev started walking from this spot. Lost. suicide report no matter what. I'll figure out where the shots came from. Got the latest generation? One that picks up the trajectory of bullets? Relax. I'm old-fashioned. I make exceptions for toys that make my job easier. <laughs> Attacker shot from the stage. Any thoughts on who did the shooting? Got a dead guy here who'd make a decent suspect. He's great at playing a dead guy. Really in character.
caliber matches the gun fired. Is it him? He shot Kovalev before he got hit himself. Bodies assigned to a user named Edmund Christo Basmond. Who the fuck is Edmund Christo Basmond? Employed by Phalanx, an elite private security company founded by someone called Miller. If I were this guy, I'd look for another job. One hit Kovalev. Why was a security guard shooting at Kovalev? Question. Something provoked him. He must have been startled to have such shitty aim. Straight in the Icarite. Whoever tapped him was a fucking excellent shot. So now the question is, who? Exactly. So long, Edmund Christo Basmond. body is no worse than paying a parking fine. Sounds like clockwork. You recognize him? John Park? The third one in the photo with Green. The main shareholder of Denver? Covered in some kind of flammable shit. We found the same substance on Kovalev. <laughs> Ribs completely crushed. Multiple minor injuries. What does it look like to you? Something exploded right next to him. Concussive force broke all his bones. Intense heat set him on fire. Shit. The poor bastard really suffered. Yeah, well, suffering's nothing new. 
Especially for people who eat Demer food. Can you find the source of the explosion? As long as this shit glows under UV light, yeah, I think so. Liberation Stadium? Shit. He seemed like a decent guy. You knew him? Nah, not really. He shook my hand a few times in the old life, that's all. Camera? Uh, it's a scarf, but yes, indeed, um, Jane Salma had a similar one. Similar? Identical? Uh-huh, but, uh, it's just a scarf. Besides, there's, there's no sign of Salma's presence? No, not yet. Yes. 
see a code on the hand. Will you check it? Expensive bodies don't usually have those. Could have been a recent purchase, maybe? Just hadn't gotten around to removing the serial number yet? Huh. Weird. It's unregistered, but the body was bought by Phalanx for... Holy shit! For four million bucks? Way too pricey for a bodyguard. Sarah, meet Mr. Miller. You think that's the owner of the company? Not only that. Arms dealer, smuggler. Don't bother looking in the system. We won't find anything. This asshole works for the government. Got some documents. I don't believe it. Do people like this always keep secret papers just lying around for anyone to see? Looks like the law on lowering the age of free subscription is just the beginning. What? They want to make it even lower? And add tons of taxes. I'd say it's a long-term plan. Have they gone fucking insane? They can't do that! Plans will have to wait. It'll be years before they're back on their feet after the transplant, especially if they go down with this airship. Are you going to download their Icarites? Uh, even if I wanted to, I don't have time for that. <sighs> right. Well, in any case, the longer the plan takes to get started, the better it'll be for the rest of us. finally hit the neon sign. The ads in the city are deadly effective. Ugh, oh, James, I'm begging you. He's got something on his neck. Agent from the department. How the fuck did he get in here? Jealous. 
Yes. visible under UV. Thanks. Undercover's blood? Ah, uh, would have let out. Must belong to the guy next door. Check the DNA for me? No data available. Shit. That's gotta be some big fish. I'll take photos. I'll identify him later. through the head. What is that? A brand name? Could be. Or maybe somebody's initials. shot through the suitcase lock. I'll check for ballistic trajectories. Side of the bar erupted. 
it in a hail of hot lead. Turn the lounges into Swiss cheese. Into what? People used to talk like that. I heard in some movie. They sat there in the lounge, all cloak and dagger and hushed tones, until the spray of bullets caught them flat-footed. He managed to scram. Agile body. Fast reaction time. Great B. Maybe even A. Where did he get the money for that? turned his brain to mush. It'll take years to reconstruct his Icarite. James, can you get into the suitcase? We know where he got the money for that hot rod body. Why is our agent neck deep in this? What's his fucking deal? Hey, I remember that agent. From Rachel's case. James. No, no, listen. If he's the guy hired to do the dirty work with Rachel, and he was up to no good here, too. We really don't have time for this. Right, right, okay. I'll haul ass. I don't think we'll get any more out of the Swiss cheese lounge. Let's move on. How can we connect it all? Trace evidence of explosives ties directly to Kovalev. I'll check around the bar again. with a hail of bullets. He finally earned a bullet himself from Oscar Wino Edmundo. Kovalev gave as good as he got. In the end, he finished off the crooked UC. It's all just... So unnecessary. Necessary or not, in the end, the Neon got him. He got hit hard. We're lucky. You know what they say. Follow the trail of blood. Nobody says that.
right. Time to break out the UV lamp. Trail leads to this guy. Another suicide? As far as the Chief's concerned? Without a doubt. We've got Kovalev's prints on the handle of the knife. <laughs> it wasn't just his drinks that had a kick. Who's the knifer? Ziggurite's cut. I'll check the blood. Another one of Miller's bodyguards. Seriously, where does he get these guys? Nice display of bravado. I bet he was in the army. You don't get reflexes like that just from a body. It takes training, years of it. I'd also say he had to use the knife, because I think by then he'd lost his gun.
didn't like this job. Instructions complete. Get the safe. Think of better ways to spend the evening. Could Green and Koval have been working together? And why did the fucking bartender want to blow himself up in this particular place? What was he hoping to accomplish? Fuck. Sarah, are you there? Buzzing over Green's corpse would get stuck on Icarus. Can't find a window to fly out of. And I suppose you're the spider, huh? No, but there's one nearby. Buzz yourself around the ripest corpse. The one you missed. What if I don't feel like it? Finding the body you missed? Isn't that your job? Time could be the net the bastard was trying to trap me in. I had to act fast.
What kind of shape is he in? Dent. Just a temporary state for big wigs like him. Unfortunately. He died from the explosion. Why was Kovalev so determined to kill this guy? He almost got away, didn't he? Do you recognize him? Wait a minute. Director. From the rotten family that invented the Icarite. His signature was on the documents from the lounge. He and the others found a way to strip the poor of their bodies to pad the pockets of rich assholes. He's just another dead asshole to me. What do you want? You have a unique chance to get justice. Desynchronize him. Buy some time for the poor people. It's just this the desecrate an Icarite and a corpse. Yes! If you shoot him through a Zikarite, he'll suffer. And more importantly, no more body taxes. It will take months, maybe years, before he gets back on his feet. You gave time to people who really need it. <laughs> Right. And what is right? Thousands of souls that will go to the memory bank. You can buy them time. Just pull the trigger. <laughs> Get out of there. 